for us tonight. Uh, a very good evening to you, Lisa. What's happening there this evening? Well, we are expecting potentially thousands of ice hockey supporters from all teams to come together for a vigil to remember Adam Johnson at the arena where he played for the Nottingham Panthers this evening following that terrible incident up in Sheffield uh, last weekend when they were playing Sheffield Steelers. Earlier uh, today, um, players uh, from Nottingham Panthers and staff members took some private time to remember Adam Johnson. Uh, this evening, it will be for members of public uh, to be allowed onto the rink uh, to sign a book of condolence and also to take part in a minute silence to remember him. Now, a little while ago, I spoke to Adam Johnson's aunt, Carrie, over in America because he'd only recently come to the UK uh, to play ice hockey. Uh, he's from a big family of ice hockey players and many of them were watching uh, the incident live um, as it unfolded. And she gave me her reaction to that and she paid a tribute uh, to Adam and said she was so shocked that it happened uh, while he was in play and in an upright position. Um, she had this to say. Adam wasn't just a hockey player. He was such a kind soul. He, uh, he would do anything. People say that, but he literally would do anything for anybody. He, he, he and his brother were made of the same cloth. They're just kind, gentle souls that just cared about people and never, ever would turn down a request from a little kid for a picture or a fan for an autograph or just to speak in front of people. Now, Carrie said how this vigil will bring great comfort to the family as they prepare for Adam's funeral in America, which is taking place tomorrow, and then a celebration of his life on Monday. Um, she also said that she hopes that all ice hockey players, whatever their level, will in time wear neck protection. Uh, we know it's ignited the debate this instance again about whether players should be uh, wearing that protection. And actually, the elite league that Nottingham Panthers play in has actually said that they're not making it mandatory, but they do strongly encourage it. And we've seen uh, sales of neck protection increase after the incident, uh, and also players taking it upon themselves uh, to wear it as well. All the while, South Yorkshire Police is investigating Adam Johnson's death. They say it could take some time. They are reviewing the footage as to what happened and they're speaking to ice hockey experts as well. A truly tragic story, uh, Lisa. We appreciate the update. Thank you so much.